Sato-kun. No, Keiji-san. What? Y yes what is it? I want to be Naho-chan's mom. Uh? Am I not good enough? Naho, it's time to eat. Okay. I'll make your lunchbox, so you just go ahead and eat, okay? Okay, I'll eat it now. Nom, nom, nom. My name is Keiichi Sato. I'm a 25-year-old single father who works in an office and who is struggling to raise a child on my own. All right. It's perfect. Not really, but I did my best. <laughs> yeah, I did do my best, right? Kun, is the lunchbox ready? Yeah, it's ready. See, it's in the shape of your favorite character. Yay! I love you, Kun. You have ketchup around your mouth. <laughs> that tickles. <laughs> it's not easy for me, since I can't rely on my parents to manage work and raising a child by myself. But... Come on, wash your face and let's get changed. Okay! Seeing Naho's smile gives me the strength to do my very best. We're going to go, Hiroko. The seat looks good. Helmet looks good. Well then, let's go! Off we go! Good morning, Sato-san. Good morning, Naho-chan. Miss Rumi, good morning! Please take care of Naho well today, too. Sato-san, you be careful, too. Ah! Good morning. Oh, someone's having a good sweat from the morning. Yeah, I managed to make it just in time. Sato-kun, you're always arriving at the office just in time. Can't you come to work a little earlier? Ugh, you're sweating so much and you look pathetic. I'm sorry, Manager Izumi. I'll be careful from now on. You're in such a hurry. But what if you get into an accident? Yes, ma'am. I'll be very careful about being in accidents. Uh, I'm, it's not that I'm worried about you personally, you know. If you cause an accident on your way to work, it'll be my responsibility too, you know? Yes, I understand. Manager Kaede Izumi is an incredible worker. She's a very scary boss and strict with herself and other workers, and she's especially strict with me. I guess that thing last month didn't sit so well with the manager, huh? I'm happy to be a member of your project, manager. It's an honor. Oh, then with me. But I'm sorry, I don't have enough capacity to do it. Unfortunately, I can't accept your offer. If I increase my workload at this point, it might affect my life with Naho. Should I have been just honest about the reason for my decision? But I feel like she'd say things like, don't use your child for a reason. And uh, I don't even mean to do that. Doesn't have enough capacity? Ugh, Satokun is a liar. He comes later than anyone else and leaves earlier than anyone else. But I know that he works more than anyone else. What is with him? Does he hate working with me that much? Good! Aho's eating her lunchbox now. Oh, you brought your lunchbox today, huh? Hey, she's so close. Oh, don't get so close to Sato-kun like that. Wow, it's in the shape of a character. Did you make this on your own, Sato-kun? <laughs> Sato-kun's handmade lunchbox. I want to see. Oh, I want to see too. Uh, I mean, I want to eat it. Well, yeah. Oh, it's so cute. Aw. Sato-kun looking embarrassed like that is so precious. Hey, hey. Did your girlfriend make that for you? What? A, a girlfriend? What? No way. Nope. Huh. See, I told you. What? Come on. Don't be so shy. It's your girlfriend, right? Right. Oh, or maybe she's not your girlfriend, but your wife? No. I made it while I made my daughter's lunch. Huh? 
You see, kids love these kind of things, right? So, even though I can't make them every day, I wanted to make them at least once in a while. I'm making them for myself first, as a test. What? You had a daughter, Sato-kun? Uh, I mean, you were married! I'm not married, but I have a daughter. I didn't want people being nosy about it, so instead of hiding it, I told them the truth about having a five-year-old daughter. Wow, seriously? Hey, hey, uh, don't you have a photo of your daughter? I want to see it too. Uh. Oh, what's wrong, manager? You're just squatting there. Are you not feeling well? Uh, sh shut up! Sato-kun! Yes? Y you better do something about that crooked tie before you start making any lunches. B besides, your desk is a mess. Someone who is good at their job always keeps their desks clean. What? Keiichi's desk is clean. Even my desk is worse than his. And his tie isn't crooked. I feel bad for Sato-kun. <laughs> Maybe she was annoyed by my ugly lunch. I can't believe that Sato-kun is a divorcee who also has a daughter. I mean... Sato-kun is still 25, right? And he has a five-year-old daughter? Is he an ex-delinquent or something? I is it maybe that the ex-delinquent couple had a shotgun marriage and then got a divorce? He's kind, gentle, and nice, but actually he used to be a delinquent? If Sato-kun has the custody of his daughter, that means that his wife must have cheated on him or something, right? So in other words, he's busy with a lot of issues like child support and visitations and whatnot. Uh, wait, what should I do? At any rate, the manager was being even more strict today. What was it that really got on her nerves? It's not like I hate her or anything like that. I'm going home now. Good work today. Sato-kun. You must be a really good father. Well, I try my best to be a decent father. I see. Sato-kun, you drop off your daughter at the daycare first, and then you come to work in the morning, right? I've made a special arrangement for you to leave your bicycle on the company grounds. Th th thank you so much! Uh, I wish I could spend more time with Sato-kun. Oh, God. If only he joined my project. Kikun! Sorry to make you wait. I'm really sorry for always being late. It's okay. I don't mind it, you know? Because you're working, Kikun. I'll do my best so that we can get home earlier. Okay. I'll do my best not to cry, too. No, you're such a good girl. I even make my little girl do her best not to cry every day. So, I won't add any more work for the moment. Alright! Our job today is done, everyone! So let's go to the Cherry Blossom Viewing Drinking Party! Hey, you are coming today, right, Sato-kun? Uh, no, I can't. I have to go pick up my daughter. Wait a minute! What is it? You're not the only one with kids, Sato-kun. I know it's tough being a single father, but wouldn't it be nice to join the company parties once in a while? I'm sure that there must be some way, like having someone look after your daughter, right? Well, yes, I'm sure there are ways. But if I'm going to look for a way, I want to find a way to spend as much time as possible with my daughter. My daughter is waiting for me, so if you'll excuse me, I'll go now. Uh, what? What is with him? He's always saying, my daughter this, my daughter that, my daughter for everything. I also, I also want to be with Sato-kun. But, Sato-kun was so handsome just now. He's always so gentle and calm. But I didn't know he could have facial expressions like that too. A man with a strong will and being mentally strong like that is just amazing. I'm just going to go ahead and... Huh? Mm. But... He's a divorcee with a kid who only thinks that his daughter is his life. 
I wouldn't mind her daughter, but... What about his ex-wife? To his daughter, his ex-wife is her mother. So it's not like she won't ever see her mother. I don't know if even I can stand that. Hey, Coon! We made a mountain! Yeah, we made a big one, huh? Wanna make a tunnel? Oh! oh. Sato-kun! Manager! Oh, uh, hello. Uh, hello? Um, you seem to be a little bit different compared to when I see you at work. Oh, is that so? Sato-kun, you too. You seem to be different from when you're at work. <laughs> Do I look like a decent dad? Well, yes. You represent the dad out of all dads. I'm happy to hear that then. Okay, Kun, who's this? Oh, hey. You can't point fingers at people. You know that, right? She's a very important person from work. Hmm. She's from your work, Kay Kun, huh? So you're Naho chan? Yeah, I'm Naho! Auntie, let's play together! No! Don't call her Auntie! And don't ask her to play! I'm really sorry about that, manager. Naho was being rude! It's okay. I do look like an Auntie to the kids anyway. Oh, let's make a tunnel! <laughs> yeah, okay. Then, let's dig from this side and that side. Manager... The manager played with Naho for nearly two hours, starting with playing in the sandbox, and then playing on the swings, playing on the seesaw, and playing tag. Thanks to this, Naho became very attached to the manager, and after being exhausted from playing with her, she fell asleep on her lap. It's unusual for Naho, who is very careful, to be so relaxed with someone she has never met before. Um, Naho has totally behaved like a spoiled child to you. I'm sorry for this, even though it was your day off today. Don't worry about it. It may come as a surprise, but I don't hate kids, you know. But may I ask you one question? Sure. Naho-chan calls you Keikun, right? Is there a reason for that? No, oh, about that. If it's a sensitive topic, then you don't really have to answer it. Uh, no, it's actually really simple. Naho is my younger sister's child, so genetically she's not my daughter, but she's my niece. Huh? My younger sister is what you would call a single mother, and I have no idea where Naho's biological father is. Our parents were very angry about the whole thing, and had cut ties with my sister, so she raised Naho by herself. But unfortunately, she passed away due to a car accident a year ago, so I decided to take Naho in and raise her. Now, Naho is my precious daughter, both emotionally and legally on the family register. So that means... Sato-kun, you have a child, but you're not a divorcee, is that right? Well, I don't even remember getting married. Then... that means you don't have an ex-wife, right? Right? If I did, that would be really scary, you know? Sato-kun! Keiji-san. What? Y yes what is it? I want to be Naho-chan's mom. Uh. Am I not good enough? W well, um, does that mean that you're proposing to me? Well, yes. <laughs> That's what I had in mind. But why me? Manager, you... You don't really like me, right? Because I put my family before work. No, you're wrong. I... Actually, I love you, Sato-kun. Sato-kun, you're kind, gentle, and you're very thoughtful. You're always making the people around you feel at ease. I'm the kind of person who makes everyone around me tense, so I admire that about you. I think it's amazing. But I'm not really good at my job, you know? Uh, that's not true. I know you're very good at what you do. Hey, 
You wouldn't want a woman who is five years older than you, who has a tough personality and works all the time, right? Manager. Manager. No, Kaede-san. Yes? I'm very happy that you still chose me after knowing about Naho. And I know you're strict, but you're also a kind person, Kaede-san. I've been able to park my bike in the company grounds, and it's been a big help to me. Then... But can you wait a little bit for my answer? When I decided to take Naho in, I gave up on my own marriage and my love life. So to be honest, it still feels all unreal to me. I'm sorry. Oh, of course. Please do take your time to answer. It's not just yours. It's also Naho's feelings, too. Besides, even if it's fine with me and Naho, I feel very sorry to your parents, Kaede-san. No parents would want to have their only daughter be married off to a single father who has never been married and who has a child. Oh, well, you don't really have to worry about that. Actually, my parents aren't my biological parents either. What? My biological father is the cousin to my father who adopted me. So my mother who adopted me and who passed away three years ago and I are completely unrelated. Why are you telling me such an important thing about you? Well, it's pretty obvious. It's because I love you. Hey, Keiji-san. I was raised by my mother who isn't related to me. And now I'm going to love and raise your daughter, who isn't related to me. Isn't this also some kind of fate? Even if you can't show your kindness and show how grateful you are to the actual person, you can pay it forward, you know? If I could, then I would pay it forward to Nao-chan and Keiji-san. Kaede-san. Please just... Let me return the favor, Keiji-san. Seeing Kaede-san's smiling face from the side, she looked so beautiful and gentle uh, that I found myself falling in love with her. Kei-kun! Kaede-chan! Congratulations! Thank you, Naho. From now on, let's get along well together, the three of us. It's not just the three of us. Grandpa's our family, too! <laughs> What, what an adorable girl! It's been six months since I've been going out with Kaede-san. We were able to have our wedding today. The only thing I'm worried about is... That Kaede-san's father is already being obsessed about his first grandchild, I guess. Thank you for watching until the end! Please subscribe to our channel and like our video because we will definitely be happy!